No. Finally, you're back. As a matter of fact, yes, I did miss you. I mean, I got right back as you were leaving. And you looked so good. It's just... The... It was practically unfair. I didn't have enough time to tell you how good you looked. Well... <laughs> Come here. Yes, but first a hug, and then I'll continue. Just come into my arms, please. <sighs> I've got you under my control. Because I have a bone to pick with you. That's why. How dare you look so delicious going out without even giving me so much as a taste. Before embarking on your trek for the day. Kept me waiting. Tell me, doesn't it feel good when someone notices how good you look? When I notice how good you look, but I can't have you until later. <laughs> like my my little box of chocolates that I can carefully unwrap. Only when you give me the signal. When you give me the okay. Hmm? Hmm? So to keep. I. Oh, oh no! I've been spotted! I am sleepy. I've had a long day's work, but. Don't worry, I'm full of energy. But I, um, I think it's sweet that you see through my <laughs> flirtations to see that I am quite tired today. <laughs> Nothing gets past my baby. It's good. It's good. Um, the thought of you kept me going, to be honest. Yeah, it was a hard day today, but nothing bad happened, so I can't complain. How could I, when I have such a box of chocolates, to keep my memory young and fresh and hip? Ah. <laughs> yeah. It... Oh, there you go getting all bashful on me. Oh. I'm sorry, Kohanya. I... I should have asked if you're in the right headspace for me to hit on you. Hit on you up and down. Uh, I'm sorry. You do? You do? Mm. Oh, okay. I just got the feeling like I made you all, you know, get all shy. And not like in a good way that I make you get all shy, but like, um, uh, unco- oh. Uneasy, kind of. <laughs> That's okay. I, I'll keep playing with your hair like this. So, tell me, my love, how was your trip? Mm-hmm. <gasps> oh, 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 my, my, my. Someone checked you out. Did they do the thing where they looked you up and down? <laughs> yeah. <gasps> Were they cute? <laughs> I'm just asking. I'm curious. That's all. Were they cuter than me? <laughs> no. You're right, you're right. That isn't physically possible. <laughs> I'm so silly. <laughs> yep, I've still got it. No, but 
seriously, were they like a nine or something? The person that hit on you. How dare they think that they can get with an 11 right now? That's you. You're the 11. Baby? What do you mean by that? No, 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 stop. Go back. What do you mean by they were probably just looking at someone else? Are you not hot? Are you not attractive? Are you not gorgeous? So... You mean to tell me that the cute person checking you out couldn't possibly be checking you out because you're not cute enough? And I think what you mean is they couldn't possibly be checking you out because they knew that if that were true, then I would specifically personally hunt them down to the edge of the earth with my compass and kunai knife and end up wearing their hide like a fur coat just for the fun of it. Be looking at my baby. Oh, yeah, you're right. They could probably sense that you were mine and they backed off to not go through the headache of Felka. <laughs> Silly. Okay. If I can be serious for a moment. I know. Felka, you're no fun when you're concerned for me. Uh. But sweetie, you're doing that thing again. Do you know what I think of all this? Kanye, I get the feeling. And you know, what do I know? But... Like, you think that other people are just better than you by default? Why would she be looking at you? Because you're gorgeous. Handsome. If I do say so myself, you have something about you that just melts me. You did when I first saw you from across the room, and you still do. You have the face of a good, kind person. I can't describe it, but you're just good. Do you hear me? Do you hear me? You know, you're quiet, so I'm gonna take the time to fill the silence with my voice. Because that's what I do when you're feeling sad and I just like the sound of my voice sometimes, but this is for you, right? I think that I really do like the fact that other people find you attractive because I know that you're mine. And then I get out, I'm in a relationship with you. Oh my God, I'm actually in a relationship with you. I get to text you and hold you and kiss you and make food for you and make you feel. Uh, the, only, the only way that I can make you feel. I get to come home to you and kiss your face and tell you how great you are. Even when you forget sometimes. <laughs> Say that again in my good ear. I like the sound of that. <laughs> you like when I get possessive over you. Me? Possessive of you? <laughs> You're cute. <laughs> well, I like it too. It's fun to pretend, you know, like you're quote unquote mine or something. And sure you are. You got a look on your face that was worried. You are. You are. Don't worry. You are mine. <laughs> For the record. Of course you're mine. You know. But. Not really. You're your own beautiful creation. Mine? <laughs> no. Not at all. If we want to get poetic about it. Or. 
rather practical about it. It's just that you love coming back to me, to my arms again and again. So how I make you feel loved and cared for, seen, heard, the way I continue to surprise you, make you exhale in pleasure under the full moon, smile with anticipation for what silly goofy thing I'll do next to make you smile. Why do you focus on your negatives rather than focusing on the good parts of yourself? Polish people, very blunt. <laughs> you looked a little shocked. <laughs> That's all. Hmm? I know it can be hard. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Am I right, ladies? <laughs> Let me start again. I... Hey, look at me. I know it can be hard to be nice to yourself. When you feel like you should be so much farther along in your life. But... Blaming yourself for the things that have gone wrong. Oftentimes we need to acknowledge what we don't like about ourselves or our life so we can move to change it, but accepting ourselves as we are now, being seated in the you that you are, so that we can make mental space and strength to become the person we want to become. It's the only way forward, as I see it anyways. Hey, it's okay. Hey, it's okay. Self esteem isn't always easy. I just um, saw something in you that I didn't like. So I thought I would remind you that um, you're special. Yes. Soft kisses for my baby always. And back rubs. Flip over for me and get comfy. I mean, you know. Back rubs. <laughs> Why am I explaining this? It's okay. <laughs> back rubs are a really good form of affection. I think it's um secondhand nature for me to find my hand at your waist or your lower back when I want to instinctively protect you, nurture you. It sends a message to your body that my body is in tune with you and is here for every part of you. The strong and the not so strong. But here's the fun part. Only you have the power to relax, to feel comfortable in your own skin, to accept the fullest part of relaxation from my back rubs. I may facilitate the relaxation, but it's your job to accept that pleasure. Does that make sense? Well, that's okay. Maybe you don't feel like yourself now. As a matter of fact, I know you don't because I know you. But that's okay. Because tomorrow is a new day. Right. Mm -hmm. Self-esteem, it doesn't always have to be at 100%. That's okay. No, stop, baby. Stop. I'm not saying anything revolutionary here. friendly neighborhood of Felka. Hey. 
Yeah, I like when you sigh like that. You know, I was um, going to cook dinner when you walked in, actually. <laughs> when you walked in with your hot stuff. <laughs> I got my mind all clouded. Ow! <laughs> but before I get rubbing your back a little nicer, <laughs> please come accompany me in the kitchen. You're my sous chef tonight, okay? Could you being cute? Mm, do you want me to say it out loud for you? Fine. Tonight, you're my little sous chef. Mine. <sighs> <clears throat> Sorry, I just watched Ratatouille for the first time in my life last night. <laughs> Let me try that again. <clears throat> you are mine. All mine. Now, and tonight, and into the morning. You got that? <laughs> Good. <laughs> I just wanted to see that expression on your face. Come on. We're cooking. We have a lot of work ahead of us. We're making a savory pie tonight. With a nice herbal gravy on top. 